In this video, we will show you how to send and receive Google Sheets data to the REST API endpoint URL. From the top bar, click on the extensions and then select the Apps Script option. Here, an Apps Script project will open. Give it an arbitrary name as per your convenience. Then you need to paste this code. You can get this script by using the link in the description box. In the Get Sheet by Name, you need to add the name of the sheet. You will find the name at the bottom right corner of the screen. Then click on the Save icon at the top. Once the script is saved, you can run it by clicking on the Run button. The execution process will take a few seconds. You can check the status in the execution log. This project requires authorization, so you need to review permissions before proceeding further. Choose your Google account, and then allow the required permissions. In the execution log, you can see the execution started and completed. Next, click on the Deploy drop-down at the top right corner and select the New Deployment option. In this pop-up, click on the gear icon and select the Web App option. Here, you need to give a suitable description. Then choose the Execute as option. At last, choose who will be going to have access to this. Once done, click on the Deploy button. You can see the deployment was successful. Now, click on the URL below. This will open up a new page. Here is all the Google Sheet data in JSON format. This URL can be used as an endpoint by software to perform some action or retrieve information. The URL has no restrictions and will open anywhere on the web, as you can see for yourself. If you open this URL in Google Chrome then you will be able to see the properly formatted JSON. You can see arrays, objects, keys, and values separately. This is because of the Chrome extension called JSONV that formats all JSON in collapsible objects and arrays. Now, we'll show you how to retrieve data from this URL to Google Sheets. For this, open a Google Sheet and then click on the Extensions option at the top. From the Add-ons, select the Get Add-ons option. Here, search for the tool called API Connector. You need to select this API connector. Click on the Install button and then select the Continue option. Here, you need to choose your Google account to link with this tool. Allow the required permissions. Within a few seconds, the API connector will be installed. Again go to the Extensions, here you'll find the API connector. Click on the Open. After this, you will sew a panel on the right. On that panel, click on the Create Request button. Then copy the URL of the sheet containing the JSON data, and paste this URL in the Request URL field. There are plenty of API request methods and we are going to choose the Get method. In the Execution Sheet field, you need to enter the name of the sheet that you will find in the bottom left corner. Once done, click on the Run button. In a matter of seconds, all data from JSON URL is now transferred to this Google Sheet. You can see information has come in the right column and the right row. And the number of records is also exactly the same. 